hello guys dance graphics here welcome back to the channel in this tutorial i will be showing you how to design this awesome birthday flyer with the help of your pixel app application then also i will be using another application that will help enhance the image quality so stay with us watch the video to the very end and do well to subscribe now without wasting much of your time let's get started so i would love to start from a fresh okay um okay so welcome back um uh, i'd love to start from here and watch the video to the end because i will show you how to get the resources so the first thing you are going to do is to go to your three dots click on image size and we are changing the width to 1024 by 1280 so click ok once you've gotten that and let's go import the background so like i always do my designs backgrounds first images follows then the text completes the design so we are going to go now to background and tell us in the comment where you are watching this video from i would love to hear from you so that we can send you a shout out in our next video now on from gallery we are going to import the background okay so here is the background i just click on this mark once you, you have the background just click here and you are good to go so we have the background here but i want this background to have more of uh, this blue color even though it's blue but i want more blue to be showing on the background so how can i do that so go to shapes select a simple um let me say a big a big uh, square shape make it to fit the design completely then we are giving it this blue color so we are giving it this dark uh, blue color for now let's see or we can even use this bright one so let's use the bright blue color okay so now go to opacity go to opacity and fade it out so i'm going to fade it out to our desired uh, level so let's see uh let's say 60 percent then we click on the check mark okay uh, i think it's too much so we can reduce it a bit let's say let's reduce this to about 40 percent okay 40 percent you are good to go then lock the image uh the shape sorry now go to your import and we're going to import the image so do well to subscribe to the channel guys for more other amazing tutorials thank you so so much so i have this image i'm going to share these resources with you don't worry all right for now just watch the video I'm going to make this one the focus of this design so centralize it uh, using your relative position then make sure it's uh, locked on the layer panel then you can now go and bring uh, this other one so we have uh, two images so I'm going to use this one also just crop this one like so and bring it here I'm going to place this one right here so we're going to make this one also to be a little bigger all right so just position it here like this then we lock everything up now after achieving this uh, we are going to put our text here so but by all means we are going to uh, put some uh, some fading here we can just write our text on this surface like this so we're going to bring in some fading and how do we do that go to your draw tool click on draw then subscribe to the channel tell us where you are watching from i will read in the first 10 comments and i will reply to all of them instantly okay so tell me which country you are watching from from nigeria or from gambia from ghana from uh, just drop your country flag all right i think that's better so let's increase the pen size of our draw and um, increase the smoothness of the draw too then go down to blend radius and increase everything now you're just going to tap your finger on the screen okay then you will see this now click on your check mark so we have this already out here so what are we going to do uh, we're just going to make it bigger okay now what color will you suggest we give this blur uh, uh, draw image that we just drew so write that in the comments also so i'm going to test your creativity your creative skills what if you're thinking right like me 
we should give it a blue color so that we have a uniform blend okay have a uniform blend but uh, we're going to reduce the opacity so reduce the opacity so we have the image here or as i can call it so we're going to reduce the opacity to 60 percent step opacity down to 60 percent we just want it to you know to just show a bit okay then make a copy bring it here all right make a copy and uh, put it here so i have something like this now just lock everything up okay now it's time for us to bring in our flower element so i have a very nice flower here so this one is blood and look at what we're going to do we're going to increase this one then size it up and click to back so we're going to send this one right to the back here to the back okay so let's see all right send it upwards a bit and what you're going to do now is to lock it up so after logging it up the next thing is to do what to bring in this other flower which is not blurred of course right so do you notice the color harmony we are using here everything is blue so there must be some harmony in your design to help it stand out okay so we are keeping true to the blue color so i reduce this one a bit and you know just position it here right then go to layer and uh, lock this up so we are done importing the images the shapes and preparing the background now it's time for us to bring in our text as per our agreement but before we do that i just want to shift this image let's shift it a bit all right i think it's too up okay then we shift the second one also please kindly subscribe to the channel and like this video drop your comments i would particularly love to hear where you are watching this tutorial from guys i would love to hear from you okay so let me know in the comments thank you so much now after achieving this um we're going to go back to text and we'll write happy birthday so we're going to write happy um happy birthday in capital letters now after writing this in capital letters go to your fonts and let's try several fonts here i want to go with trajax first of all let's see or let's say Montserrat bold right Montserrat bold so reduce it in size then go to what to your spacing go to spacing not line spacing guys go to spacing subscribe the, to the channel to understand like the video to understand so look at what we did we increased the spacing by 100 percent complete subscribe to understand if not you will not understand please subscribe to understand so click on related position and make sure that this is positioned to the middle so we uh, we can try another phone i think that Montserrat is somehow so let's try trajax trajax all right so we have trajax yeah i think trajax is giving me uh that vibe that i want so we're using trajax phones for that that's uh the purpose of design you have to be creative guys you have to be creative okay um let's shift this text a little like so okay so that it can correspond with the image now after doing this we're going to bring in uh an icon okay uh i have some icons here all right so um we have this so i'm going to use this one reduce it in size neatly then let's go to color filters let's filter out this color to get blue so filter it out completely to 180 then you'll get the blue color so make sure that it's on blue okay so make sure it's on blue then just position it here like so then uh let's reduce it a bit let's see 
okay good so go to your shapes go to shapes click um, and select a simple circle let's give this circle a dark a blue color this is the color that we want to use okay this one a dark blue color so just reduce it in size neatly and uh, position it right in the middle of this icon we want it to cover the middle part of that icon so let's do that okay good so everything is moving on as planned and uh, we are going to lock that up so after logging it up after logging that up we're going to go to text and write a date so this birthday is coming up on the 20th of march 2025 so i have 20th march 2025 make this to be in caps then um, we're going to maintain the same font trajax and uh, this time around we're going to bold it so go to style click on your style and uh, click on bold so we want to bold this text and see how it looks and bring it here reduce it in size just break it into three beautiful lines and that's it so go to alignment and click on this alignment we want the text to be middle alignment to so have a middle alignment so increase it a bit and just make sure that the size of the text is suitable enough uh, for it to fit on that icon so i've traded march 20 25 that's the day of the birthday and um so we're going to write the name of the birthday girl so her name is gifty 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 i don't know whether it's gifty or gifty uh if your name is gifty just let us know in the comments or if you know someone whose name is gifty let us know in the comment i trust my nigerian guys surely there should be someone from there that has the name gifty so i'm going to go to font and this time around the phone i'm using uh it's called the alexandra uh, um amsterdam sorry amsterdam of um, amsterdam let me check it out which one is good so we're using amsterdam 2 z1 font but then you can use any other script font here there is just no problem with that all right so increase this in size okay so i think that uh, z2 is not good enough let's check another font style um okay so we are using amsterdam 4 okay amsterdam for for that text okay good so this is exactly what we want and uh, we are going to try and see if we can align to the middle okay yeah so that's cool now we're going to copy this text and write best wishes our best wishes for our very best wishes for the birthday um, happening to her so we can reduce this in size a little bit use little position to make sure that it's also uh, aligned properly to the middle okay guys so after achieving this um, everything is done on pixel lab the next thing we're going to do now is to save our work as PNG we're done with the normal design on a pixel lab so we're going to proceed now to the next powerful application and just stay with us by subscribing to the channel i will be showing you that application in a while while waiting for the design to save all right so it's done saving subscribe to understand the video right so we're going to the next uh, application it's called snapseed very powerful so once you open your snapseed if you don't have snapseed just quickly download it on google play store and uh, sign up with your email is free of charge then you will see this interface pop up now we're going to click on the plus two to
to import the design so here we are and the first thing the very first thing we're going to do after importing our design is to go to tools so go to tools so this tutorial is a two in one it helps you to understand pixel art design and at the same time it gives you an insight on how you can edit your designs using snapseed so you are literally using one stone to shoot two birds all right so um once you're on two you want to click on twin image first of all let's tune the image so we're going to begin with brightness let's give it a little touch of brightness by eight well, let's check it out and try to reduce the brightness um by minus seven then let's go to the contrast let's increase the contrast okay let's increase the contrast i hope you are seeing the after effect so let's go to don't touch the saturation go to ambience so i uh this is where i'm clicking okay click here to be seeing the other options so we go to ambience ambience here means uh the overall feeling around the image the overall feel around the image so we want to make it very much vibrant um, increase it a bit then go to highlights uh, and give it a very bright highlight then we also go to shadow let's reduce the shadow a bit All right can you see that so reduce the shadow then we go to warm and since the image is uh, since the design is done with a cool color their colors in the color theory and design they are cool and warm colors so um this one this design is using we're, do, we're doing it using a cool color which is blue it's really a cool color so we're going to reduce the warmness to the negative side to give it that befitting look now if i take you to the positive side so be looking here uh, these are some uh, tricks on image editing so if you come here if you come here and increase the the warmness i hope you can see since the design is done on a cool uh, color it becomes ugly but now let's try to reduce the warmness can you see that so it gives a very vibrant and befitting look so uh we're okay with that any other thing no so that's all now you're going to click here on the check mark and that's it now let me show you the before and the after so this is before from pixel app and this is the work of snapseed can you see that awesome right okay so uh this image looks bright but i just wanted us to give it another uh additional editing all right so go to tools once again and click on details so on details we're going to add the structure of the image okay then uh, we sharpen the image as well so let's make it sharp very sharp um to about 67. now once you've achieved all of these you want to click now on the check mark and yeah that's it so the last thing we're going to do now is to export our design so click on save and it's saving so let's check it out um let's check our design so this is the work of snapseed it helps to enhance your designs right so uh, this is a very simple yet straightforward pixel uh, birthday design for gifty we're wishing her well as she celebrates her birthday on this 20th of march okay um this is the before with the pixel lab and the after using snapseed if you haven't subscribed to the channel you yourself you can confirm that you are missing a lot by not subscribing to stay with us so subscribe to the channel like the video drop your comments drop your country flags i'll be reading your comments and we'll be picking the first 10 comments to reply to them instantly thank you so much for watching the video until we meet again next time it's Tons graphics god bless you